an alma mater? Well, the Latin phrase actually means generous or giving mother. And we use this phrase for the college that you have chosen to attend. We also use this phrase to, it, for the school song um, that is your college's school song. This is different from the fight song. It's the song that we all sing together to sort of remind us of how generous our giving mother alma mater our college is. The next phrase goes like this. I the beach is event. Now that should sound familiar. Those are two buildings on campus. They're two of our oldest buildings on campus. Obviously, Sturdevent is one of the most recognizable, the one with the big tower. Beecher is actually one of the oldest buildings, the oldest college buildings in Illinois. It currently houses Sigma Pi and Phi Alpha uh, literary societies, but it is also the oldest um, college building and is where many of our classes began at Illinois College. Moving on to the next phrase. Here we sing our loving praises. Here we renew our covenant. Covenant's kind of an old word. And it actually, yes, it means promise, but it also kind of means a document, sort of like um, that you might sign, you know, a, um, a commitment. It's emotional, but it's also lawful. The idea is that you have agreed to come here. We are going to teach you. We have agreed to teach you, and we've all entered into this covenant together. Hail forever, alma mater. May thy children bring thee fame. Now you are the alma mater's children, and you're supposed to bring the college fame. The idea is that you take the knowledge that you gain here, and you go out into the world and do something wonderful with it. And we know that you're going to. Hail forever, Illinois, in our hearts shall live thy name. Now, every time you hear that, and you hear that melody every day at noon. It's played from the Rammel Camp Chapel um, bells. You'll hear that melody and you'll have an idea about what the words are. You might even be able to sing along. In fact, three of the lines of music are exactly the same. Number one, number two, and number four are all the same music. And we're going to sing it all the way through from beginning to end so that you can hear those similarities and hear all those wonderful words. And here we go. Mm -hmm. 